Next is hallmark on gold jewelry. What are the five compulsory symbols? See, before starting this hallmark, ये शुरुआत हुआ था फ्रॉम द ईयर 2000. तो 2000 से पहले दिस सिंबल सिस्टम वाज नॉट देयर. तो पुराना ज्वेलरी अगर कोई लेकर आ रहा है तो डेफिनेटली आई आई ऑलरेडी टोल्ड यू वंस आर आस्क द पर्सन आई टोल्ड दैट उसमें हॉलमार्किंग सिंबल नहीं होगा एंड इट डजंट मीन की दैट इज नॉट गोल्ड एट ऑल बिकॉज़ दिस वाज इंट्रोड्यूस्ड ओनली फ्रॉम द ईयर 2000. सो व्हाट आर द फाइव कंपल्सरी सिंबल्स? फर्स्ट इज बी आई एस यानी ब्यूरो ऑफ इंडियन स्टैंडर्ड का हॉलमार्क सिंबल can be in carat can be in percentage or it can be in parts also third one is the center which is doing this type of printing or the stamping that is called as a saying and hallmark centers showroom uh, yani it will be registered and it has a particular registered logo for itself it will be on the third one and fourth one is a year of marking year of the marking in the sense As I told you, it started from the year 2000. So 2000 में बना हुआ कोई भी आभूषण है तो उसमें English alphabet A लिखा हुआ होगा. If it is made in 2001, it will be English alphabet B. 2002 है तो C. ऐसे अलग-अलग साल के लिए अलग-अलग English alphabet होगा. So last ज्वेलर्स उसके लिए अलग सा एक लोगो होगा ऐसे अलग अलग ज्वेलर्स के लिए अलग अलग लोगो सो दिस इज फाइव कंपल्सरी सिंबल एंड 2016 के बाद ईयर ऑफ मार्किंग इज कैंसल क्योंकि उसमें थोड़ा सा कंफ्यूजन हो रहा था सो इट वाज एक्चुअली कैंसल्ड सी देखिए दिस इज द हॉलमार्क सिंबल पी आई एस प्यूरिटी गवर्नमेंटरीटीन 22 carat all the three carats has to be uh, 100 percent they has to be compulsory symbol because kya hota tha generally 14 carat mein abushan ko bana kar what they do is if they put 14 carat as they, they are selling nobody is ready to buy hai na kyunki 14 carat ko koi bhi pasand nahi karenge so isi liye kya karte hain 14 carat ke upar they make the original jewel of 14 carat but they put the marking as 18 carat and they sell it off so what we do when we go for valuation we see on the hallmark so when we see the hallmark it will be written as 18 carat and we take it into consideration that it is 18 carat and we give the gold loan but originally what it is it is only 14 carat so you see the government has put the rule that if it is 14 carat then it should be hallmark as 14 carat only if it is 18 carat then it has to be written as 18 carat only so for the three carats they have put it to compulsory that hallmark should be there but how to find out whether it is fake or original hallmark for that you should see the assing center logo usually kya hota hai agar aise fake hallmark symbols koi dal raha hai and to khud ka symbol wahan pe wo nahi dalega it means that assayer symbol ya hallmark symbol wahan pe nahi hoga clear so this is the uh, five compulsory symbols it has become as four and if it is fake definitely hallmark symbol wahan pe nahi hoga apart from this also we will use a technique which i will be telling you tomorrow how to find out the difference between 14 carat and 18 carat that also i will tell you but generally without any testing agar aapko waise hi bolna chahiye to isme ek symbol miss hoga that symbol is a sing center logo and this is the soldering steps ki soldering kaise karna hai how to use the flux and all that i have given the theory part already aapke paas hoga for a valuation purpose aapko soldering zyada hai ya kam hai so wo dekhna chahiye apart from this soldering kitna kiya hua hai all these things it is we there no need to worry more about that 
टाइप ऑफ सोल्डरिंग ट्रेडिशनल सोल्डरिंग है कैडमियम सोल्डरिंग है हॉलमार्क सोल्डरिंग है अगेन आई एम रिपीटिंग इट सोल्डरिंग इज नो वेर रिलेटेड टू प्योरिटी अंटिल एंड अनलेस ज्यादा सोल्डरिंग किया हुआ है तो देन प्योरिटी कम होगा बट इफ इट इज ओनली वन और टू सोल्डरिंग ओनली एक या दो जगह में सोल्डरिंग किया हुआ है तो देन इट इज नॉट गोइंग टू अफेक्ट टू मच ऑफ द प्योरिटी so but still you should be having knowledge about what is soldering how we are being doing soldering in the so that's why i'm discussing this what is soldering see hard soldering medium and soft soldering so in apart from this you also have something called as cadmium soldering which we call it as kdm soldering and then is hallmark soldering so hard soldering ka matlab this is a filler powder filler powder is nothing but to be in a practical language that is like a gum or flux which is used for attaching to joining two ornaments so for instance if in a chain you are going to attach a dollar you are going to make the filler powder keep in between the dollar and the chain you are going to keep and you are going to lightly heat it up when you heat it up that filler powder is going to melt and it is going to fix the two points that is the chain and the dollar so that is called the filler powder with respect to the filler powder you term it as either hard or medium or soft next is cadmium method it means the filler powder which you are going to use has 1 gram powder of gold and 100 grams of cadmium yani they are using cadmium for soldering purpose like uh, you you call it as ferricol also right ferricol or gum is nothing but cadmium here so here they what they do is kdm hallmark jewelry whatever the print is nothing but the soldering cadmium but it's very bad for health i already told you penne mein koi dikkat nahi hai it is a problem the next but the best method is the hallmark soldering hallmark soldering you don't use any method that is you don't you are not using cadmium you are going to use zinc instead of a cadmium you are going to use zinc and there is a small correction it is 1840 mg it is not grams please do change it the best way no wastage low melting point it is 1840 mg yani it is 1.840 grams either way you can write it this may you are going to use a little bit of zinc for attaching to soldering uh, places so zinc is nothing but when you uh, use zinc as a soldering uh, material when you melt it or when you heat it zinc will melt and it will easily evaporate so that there will be no wastage so for everyone this hallmark with the usage of zinc is more recommendable and you can call it as 24 hallmarking Hallmark soldering, that is the name of using this. Even today also business purpose के लिए cadmium hallmark को ही इस्तेमाल कर रहे हैं. But this is the most recommendable or the best method, and it is definitely this costly also. So अगर business में profit देखना है तो many of them don't use this method. Next topic, electroplating. What is electroplating? How you are going to do 